Hey everybody, welcome back to Let's Play Batman Arkham Asylum. Ryan here with you, and this Let's Play is brought to you by MuchGames.ca, obviously. So, basically, we're in this room with the gas. Yeah, the poison gas, we gotta rescue a doctor, and a god. And... I... F oh yeah, I had... So when I turned off the game, uh, it brought me to the last checkpoint. So, that guy that was handing last time? Yeah. He's hanging again. There is a switch, but I think it might be underneath where I'm to, so I might have to change my angle. Yeah, I do actually. I'm trying to get that to work. But it won't. Oh, there we go. Uh, no. Move over this way. I'm gonna cut him down again. Actually, you're supposed to do that. Oh, it's right below there. I see it. I see it. I can't okay. Nope. Oh, I see it. I have to clear the room of toxin as quickly as possible. So let's go over this way, and I should be able to hit that now. Perfect. So that doesn't take care of everything, but it does take care of a bit of it. Oh, look, the Joker teeth. <laughs> That's not what I was trying to do. I think I actually gotta glide over there. And actually get there is gonna be interesting. Cause somehow I think Okay, wait, I already did that, right? Do I have to do it again? No. Okay. I don't have to do it again, even though I thought I would have to, because you know Bow into the gas! Alright. So let's make that gap. Jeez. <laughs> you press the freaking go button, hold the one button, and sometimes it's not working. So I press the button guard button, and yeah, he just wants to drop, apparently. Yeah. Because I know where the next switch is, it's all the way over there. I was actually going to see if I can hit that, uh, Joker face from here, or uh, teeth from here. Yeah, see the next switch is over there. Perfect. Just wanted to guarantee it. Next switch is over there. Alright. Enough climbing around. Let's actually go do what we're supposed to do. So let's make this gap. Sorry about that, I had to go and get a drink. And while I did that, I managed to make. I just went and did make the gap. Jump the gap. Ah. Good, Pepsi. We gotta climb up here. We're gonna have to run over there now. And now we gotta run over there. Because right below us is that switch, but we can't hit it from here. Oh, that pillow got in the way. Like angle myself better here. That's what I'm not doing today. Sucky game boy, a Batman right now. Yeah. Sorry about that interruption. Yeah, uh, had, <laughs> had to go take care of something else. There we go. I think the pillar's in the way. 
Yeah, pillars in the way. Definitely. Let's angle it better. There we go. Two out of three. So now the next one is in that little room there where we actually took out the guy that was handing. Because we had to do that in order to break that. Otherwise, we wouldn't be able to do the next part. Ooh, good thing that didn't knock me down. Objective complete. An animatic cutscene. Alright, so we got Aaron Cash's ba background. We'll talk to him. So what's going on? My radio went dead soon after you brought Joker in. I don't know. We lock him up. Gets out and I do believe there's an audio tape in here. Yep, yeah, there it is. And there we are, more middle earth bio tapes. So now we still have to rescue the other two doctors. So that's what I'm gonna do in this whole episode, rescue all three of them. We just rescued the first one. And we have two more. Uh, I'm just seeing if there's anything else I've lying around here like middle earth trophies. I could go back up and take care of the, the teeth, but I don't think there's really anything in here besides that switch that was there for the ventilation. Uh, hmm. Nope. Okay. And all those over there is the fan and the ladder, and we don't need to go those ways. So let's go to the door that's over here. Now this part looks familiar. We've been here before. There is still medical staff needing my help. Will all patients please remain calm and move slowly to their accommodation? That wasn't there last time. Our findings have oh, the teeth. About whether psychosis is in itself with this topic. And whether potentially damaging changes to the brain are related to the length of psychotic episodes. And we destroyed, uh, did another Villa challenge by destroying teeth. Is there only 200 and something of those? 250 or 260 Villa challenges? And that weren't gonna do them all. This is not a 100% walkthrough, by the way. Basically, I'm just going from the beginning of the game to the ending of the game and doing the main story. I'm not going to collect every single thing in the game. I think I already mentioned that back in the previous part that this was not a 100% walkthrough. Same thing with my Tomb Raider LP. We yeah. represent all medical specialties and offer a. The same thing I'm using about my Mario Luigi and possibly Wind Waker. I'm not going to do 100% on everything. The second doctor is okay. That's definitely electrified. Just to double check. Yep, definitely electrified. I smell a trap. It's a trap. Batman! Don't speak. You're safe now. 
But, but it's a trap. I know. Just not for me. <gasps> it's true. You really are the world's greatest detective. How did you do that, Bats? Now, oh, what the hell? Get down there, boys. See if he can detect being punched in the face. So, this is the doctor's easy to get. Both doctors, the first doctor and the second doctor. The first one I just did, and this one are easy to get. The third doctor is pretty easy to, uh, from what I remember. There's a trick to it, though. But more about that when we get there. You guys are taking a bit longer to take out tonight. Just soon. Now, buddy, why are you trying to rip that off the wall? Roundhouse. Roundhouse. Alright, no, basically. Don't get too full of yourself, that is Bats. it. I'm just softening you up. Think of this as a preview to the main event. So now we got this doctor rescued. I'm sorry. I tried to tell you, but I couldn't speak. Relax, you're safe now. I can handle these low-life thugs. And we can move on to... I don't think we can go this way anyway. No. Okay. Oh no, there is a Riddler trophy over there. Is there? No, I guess there must be another way to get up there after. Maybe. Anyway, not gonna worry about it. Let's go and find the third doctor. Ah, there they are. Greatly, great that they're on our map. Which is great. Remember, a happy patient is a quiet patient. Oh, what the hell is in that? Oh, more teeth. I'm going to ignore those. There's really no sense of uh, dealing with those teeth right now. Well, I take another sip of Pepsi. I believe. When Amadeus. Let me just check my map again. No, other way. Yeah, it's the other way. Yeah, we gotta go this way. Because we already came in that way. Uh, ah, it's just a simple file in the corridor. Uh, alright. Where are they? Yeah. Oh, I think Oh, the cape was in the way, but it looks like we probably found house him again. Go for this door. Now, I'm gonna show you what happens when you screw this up. No, seriously, I am. There is a doctor in the middle room surrounded by six henchmen. If they get alerted, I'll show you what happens. See? She's dead. Someone tell Joker. This is what happens. Too easy. Play you like you a get game over. And cut your string. Because you have to make sure that doctor survives, and you have to kill all six men at the same time. How do you do that? I will show you. So yeah, let's let's grapple up here. And I'll show you what you gotta do. First of all, let's pick up this Riddler trophy. So you're gonna need your explosive gel for this. 
So make sure you're in detective mode, if need be. And what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to see how there's three men here. There's also three men on the other side. So if you do this wrong, like I said, if you do this wrong, I already put the explosive gel on that side, on that door. Now, there's also explosive gel that we gotta put here. Okay. So once we put the explosive gel here, yeah. By the way, I, I put the explosive gel before I, I had to pause the video for a second. And anyway, the explosive gels will go at the same time and it will blow both walls up, killing all six men and leaving the doctor intact. Therefore, the doctor is safe. If you do the gel on one wall and don't know about the second the second wall, and you only know about one wall and do it, you'll get the same cutscene where Buddy shoots her with the shotgun and then Joker comes up and basically tells you that, you know, game over basically. You gotta retry. So make sure you put the explosive gel and you set it on both walls and then you hit the RB, uh, R, the well, RBR if you're using the controller, in this case for me, and blow both walls up at the same time. That way, you kill all six men, and the doctor survives. What's going on? They were talking like they were in control. Is it true so that now that we got that done, that means yes. all but three doctors are safe. We may now finally be able to go I'm after Commissioner Horton again. For months when he broke out, the warden was very specific. He wanted Joker cured. That and Holly Quinn, of course. Campaign for mayor. That'll be the least of it. God, I almost forgot. They said they were moving through the facility. Hunting but after this cutscene, I'm probably going to stop the video. And we're going to make our way back to basically where we saved the where the elevator was to. That room with the elevator. In the center. We're going to make our way back there now. But I'll start that in the next episode. Just because. This episode's gone on long enough there. So, thanks for watching, guys. And I shall see you all in the next part of Batman Arkham Asylum. Peace out.